How you doing? This is Brian Martin with Powerhouse Painting. Here this video is going to show you the basic tools that you'll need to do to start your interior painting project. I'll start from the right and work my way to the left. Before you go into a project, you want to make sure you tarp off all the floor space that you'll be walking on and especially the ones that you'll be painting on. So definitely start off with, with laying the tarp down. To your left is Drydex. It's a lightweight spackle that goes on pink and turns white when it's dry. Really recommend this for small nail holes to large holes and uh, drywall repairs um, for your interior project. Also you'll need is your caulk gun and caulk. Um, this is for any gaps that you'll see within the wood. So a lot of times that your crown molding or baseboards you'll see that light gap. That's where you'll be using that. Also to the left is a uh, five in one. It's a basic painting tool that we use it for as a spackling knife but also to open up gallons of paint. Once your spackle is dry you really are going to need to take the time to make sure you sand that spot correctly. The recommend instead of having to use sandpaper is a painter's sander block and that's perfect. Just give it a light sand and you'll be ready to roll. Also we um, tend to bring with us is a multi-size screwdriver kit for Phillips and flat heads. It definitely comes in handy when you get that smaller or extra large screw or flat head. When you get ready to paint you're going to start to need to tape out stuff and those for those hard to reach places. So if there's something that shouldn't be have paint on it definitely take the time and, and cover it. On your left right next to the tape is a empty gallon of paint as well as a paint brush. So when you get start cutting, you really want to use an empty gallon bucket and pour just a quarter of the way of paint um, and it makes it a little bit lighter and also less room um, if you spill. So once you use that, what we always use is a five gallon bucket uh, with paint and it comes with a five gallon grid as well as a nine inch frame and nine inch pad. We seem that this takes up less bait and lot less chance for uh, spillage. Once you get everything tarped and the walls prepped, and you're getting the paint in the five gallon. We use a standard uh, painter's pole that screws on um, to the end of the nine inch frame. Um, and if you have any hard to reach spots, this extendable ladder will reach anywhere from four feet, six feet to 20 feet. So these are a few basic tools that we use every day when working on an interior project. So if you have any interior projects, I recommend using these tools. If you have any questions, please visit our website at powerhousepainting.org or visit our blog spot at powerhousepainting.blogspot.com. Thank you.